guys, it's Lily. So today I'm going to be doing a get ready with me talking video because you guys seem to really like those. They're usually really long, but you guys all like them, so I'll do them. Today I'm going out with my family to go see the Christmas Carol, and it's an every year thing that we all do, and I'm really excited. Is this exposure too much? I don't know. But yeah, so I'm going to be doing like a burgundy, kind of like smoky eye, so let's just get started. I know, I'm really ugly up close. I am first going to take the Lorac Pro palette, huh? Wow. Oh wait, actually no, I'm gonna do a primer first. <clears throat> I'm gonna take one of these Urban Decay primers. Yeah, I'll take anti-aging. It's kinda dry. Just put that all over my eye. So now I'm going to go in with cream. And I'm just going to put that all over my eye. I'm gonna go in with my Sigma brush. I, I washed it and then it got messed up, but whatever. So I'm gonna go in with taupe right here, and I am just going to put that like in my crease. All right, so that's gonna be like our blending color. We're just going to start deepening it up. So we're first going, I'm, I'm, me. I'm first going to take this NYX Smoky Fume, Fume, I don't know, palette, and I'm going to use this burgundy-ish purple shade, and I'm going to put that all over my lid. <laughs> Alright, wow, it looks really good. So now I'm gonna go in with this dome crease brush and we're basically, first I'm actually just going to clean up that. I'm gonna use this eye shading brush. It's Sigma E55 and I'm gonna take the exact same color. Pretty much all I'm going to do is I'm gonna smooth out the lines and get like a crisp line. Even though we're gonna blend it out, you'll see what I'm gonna do. So that is what I did. So now I'm going to go in to this. I've had this for forever. Color design, I should probably get rid of it. Guest list. Well, anyway, it's kind of just like a dark red, purple. Uh, it's a dark color. And all I'm gonna do is just darken up the outer edge. Then I'm gonna go back in with taupe and my huge blending brush, and I'm just gonna blend that out so there's no harsh lines. Actually, I'm not gonna use that brush anymore. I'm gonna use this one because it's a, a lot more, you know, uh, I can control it a lot better. There we go. So now, I'm going to take this Bare Minerals. This is in Velvet Charcoal. So it is a black, a charcoal color. If you don't know what charcoal is, then you should probably look it up. <laughs> but it's matte, so we're just going to add that in the crease and the outer V. Back with taupe. All right, so we're gonna go in with this deep purple in the Rock Pro, and I'm just going to tap that on like the middle to outer edge. Again, blend it out, of course. So then I'm gonna go back to the NYX and I'm gonna take the purple again. And we're just going to put that on like the inner part and get the purple right in the crease. Look crazy. So we're not gonna do anything underneath until we put on our foundation. Now, I'll put nude on the inner part, so I'm gonna take a little brush. I'll take my pencil brush, which has color on it, but it's fine. It's like a dark color, so it doesn't matter. So we're just gonna lighten that up right in the inner corner. Okay, so we're not gonna do anything else with the eyes until we get our foundation on, so we're going to go ahead and start with our foundation. So I have this How to Look Your Best at Everything kit. I've got it, like, 
almost a year ago and I haven't used it or maybe like over in the summertime. But it has the primer, foundation, concealer, and powder. So I'm going to use that today. So I'm going to use the Professional Primer. I've never used this. I'm excited. So it looks like a skin color. It's really thick. It kind of like evens out skin tone. Yeah, I don't know why my under eyes are so dark. Recently they've been like really dark. Oh, I want to update you guys about how I'm feeling. So I uploaded that video yesterday. I uploaded it. When I'm filming this, it was yesterday. It was weird, like I uploaded it, and then I was feeling like just a mess. And then I got a bunch of comments, and I was like, oh my gosh, wow. And then I got texts, and I got some texts from my church family. And I was like, this is weird. Pretty much, I decided that I'm gonna go back to my old church because that is where I feel I belong right now. And I know I had different feelings a couple weeks ago, but I'm feeling like I need to go back. And I'm feeling like that's where God is calling me. So, and I'm feeling a lot better. I am changing my ways today forward. I'm not going to associate myself with people that lead me away from God. Yeah, that is what is happening with my life. All right, so while I'm waiting for that to set, I'm gonna do my eyebrows. I did my eyebrows and I'm going to highlight under my brow bone as well this concealer brush all right there we go so that is what that is right now so now we're gonna put on that foundation hello flawless oxygen Wow um hello oh very liquidy I hate this foundation. This is terrible. I don't know if it's because I waited too long to use it or what. So it was like sticking to everything. It barely gave me any coverage. Sorry, Benefit. That's that's just really bad. So I'm gonna go back with my loved Dewy and Smooth Fit Me foundation. And that's a yellow tint. This is like a pink undertone. Yeah, I love this stuff, Wayne. Wet doing that. Master Conceal in Fair. Cake face. And more highlighting. Ah! My face is cake. First, what we're gonna do is wet my beauty blender. Probably should have just should have put on that foundation and then when I didn't like it, take it off and then put their stuff on, but whatever, you know what? Whatever. This is my wet beauty blender. Did my Rimmel Stay Matte Powder. Set that, so we're gonna take the air spun and we're going to bake now. Hopefully that will make everything look a little bit better. Contour? Sure. I'm gonna take Chocolate Soleil Bronzer, which is my favorite. Okay, then I'm gonna take my foundation brush, dip that in there. I'm gonna take the back of this and Always go up with your contour, never down, because it makes it look weird when you go down. Okay, I think we can take this off now. This looks so bad. Like, it looks so bad that I might have to redo it, because I hate it when it does that. If you don't know what I'm talking about, I'll show you. So, 
but there's clumping right here like it looks really bad like it it's just disgusting so i'm gonna take that off so i'm gonna go back and i'm going to put this and then i'm gonna put this on i did that and i baked so i'm gonna wipe that off now looks so much better oh, so i'm gonna do a little bit more of contouring Um, okay, so now I'm just going to, so I'm going to take some black, I'm going to take Crave and the Naked Basics, and I'm just going to smoke out my lash line. I have this Bare Minerals Round the Clock Midnight Eyeliner. I'm just going to do it on my top. I'm going to do a little bit of under eye stuff. So I'm gonna take the purple color. All right, so the awesome thing about my look is what I'm gonna do is I'm going to do a little bit of glitter under here. My sister has glitter adhesive and I do too, but hers is better. It's a glitter sparkle bond. I'm gonna take that on this brush. And then I'm gonna take this glitter, the Revlon Diamond Lust, because I really like this and it looks good with this look. This is a small smudge, it has a lipstick on it. I need to clean my brushes really bad. And then, okay, my camera just like pooped on me, like died. I put those sparkles on, but I kinda want like more. I have this Chanel stuff, it's New moon, so I'm gonna put that. I'm gonna put a little bit more glitter. My eyes look pretty good. So now I'm gonna put on some thick eyelashes, lash adhesive. Then we're gonna put on these Ardell Wispies. Now I'm going to put on better than set. So. Okay. so we're gonna let that dry. I'm gonna clean up a little bit and then I'm gonna come back to my lips. She's not shy, six color blush palette, and I'm gonna take this one right here. Like just a little tiny bit goes a long way. And then I'm gonna also do some highlight with the Candlelight Glow by Too Faced. And I'm gonna do dip it in both of them. Mmm, that's a good highlight. So I'm gonna outline with this nude color. And then I'm going to take Melted Long Wear Lipstick. And I'm going to put a little bit of lip, no! lip gloss. This is the Bare Minerals Marvelous Moxie. Finally, it's over! Thank you so much for watching. I love you guys so much. Thank you for being there for me. Thank you for being concerned. Thank you for helping me. Thank you for everything. I just love you guys so much. Like, I don't know what I would do without YouTube. I'm so glad I started it, like, three years ago. Even though I only have, like, 3,000 subscribers. You know what? Those 3,000 are my best friends. Okay? Love you guys. Bye.